All right, so I wanted to put together a quick video on how you can change your tires, add your tires, add fuel, all that sort of thing with just the push of a button utilizing uh, iRacing's hotkeys. Uh, they have the quick chat set up, so, you know, if you hit one, it says pitting in, pitting out, pass left, pass right, that sort of thing. You can actually change all of those in your setting and have it actually affect your car while you're racing. So this way, if you don't have a mouse handy or if you're racing in VR and you can't really get to your mouse or keyboard or any of those sort of things, you can actually use the, uh, the hotkeys to add fuel, add tires, remove tires, all that sort of thing. So I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. Um, all you have to do is in the options setting, go down to option and you'll see your auto text chat. And right now, this is how I have it set up uh, for doing hosted races. I have my, my league discord, that kind of thing. And then here you'll see all of this mumbo jumbo um, in there. So in order to use a command, iRacing uses either the... Uh, the pound key or the hashtag or whatever you want to call it, uh, and then a dollar sign to finish your command. So for this, I have it set up to clear my tires. So whenever I'm racing, and I saw a couple comments saying, oh, what do you mean hashtag clear tires? That's in there so when I hit this button, Alt-1, I have a uh, Elgato stream deck that I use uh, for a bunch of different hotkeys, and that's one of them, to clear my tires. Um... I use that to add fuel as well. I have a couple other uh, keys on my stream deck to use that. Um, and you could do a whole lot more things. I found that out actually on a website, which I am going to link in the description of this video, but it's simracingcockpit.com. And you can use uh, macros, and I'll show that right here on the screen. Um, so you see... You can use it to clear your tires, add fuel. This is in liters, but instead of putting an L, you just put a G for gallon. Uh, you could use, you know, to clear your fuel. So if you don't want to add fuel, if you're doing a fixed race or something like that, and you don't need to add fuel, you could just hit that instead of mousing over into the one of, one of the buttons and hitting the uh, little check mark. Um, further down here, you could tell to add plus 10 liters, minus 10 liters, um, if you want to add tires plus fuel, they can do that. So this one, left front, right front, left rear, right rear, um, add fuel 25, 50, 75 liters, and then just all full, all that kind of stuff. And, <clears throat> excuse me. So all you have to do is add the hashtag or pound symbol, whatever it is you want iRacing to do and then add the little dollar sign at the end, and that's exactly what's going to happen. So let's jump back into the car here, and I'll show you how all of that stuff works. So you get in. I'm just going to drive it off of off of pit road here. A few clean laps to get our fuel number. Just to get going. So if you take a look at the top of the screen, I'm now going to switch over here, hit clear tires. And hitting clear tires, as, as you can see, got rid of my uh, checkbox here on the bottom. Uh, let's see, for fuel, if I want to add fuel, plus one gallon. Doesn't really do much because it's already at max, but if you see how where it says add, that, that goes down. So if I'm using the pit calculator or something like that, and it's sitting there saying, oh, you only need to add seven and a half gallons... Well, we'll just keep hitting this button until we hit 7 gallons. Maybe even up into 8.2. This makes things a lot easier so you don't have to worry about, you know, messing over. I have my, uh, a uh, D-pad on my wheel that I can use to set and go to the next black box, as you can see. Um, but even then, I would still have to go in turn off fuel, turn back on, auto fuel if I need to, turn that off. Um, if I want to add tires back on, I'm going to have to manually go in. Or I could set up another hotkey that tells iRacing to add these back on. 
So now I just went back in to add the check marks back. I can hit my clear tires. And it just went ahead and changed that off. I hope that helps you with uh, making things a little bit easier so you don't need to worry about using a mouse and clicking over from one one section to the other to the other. And, uh, you know, hopefully that wins you some f fuel mileage races instead of, oh man, I forgot to, you know, I only wanted a couple gallons instead of, you know, 50 gallons. Now you can do that. If you have any questions, obviously feel free to uh, leave them in the comment section below. I always try to do my best to get back with everyone who comments and and, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, and yeah, stay tuned for some more fun videos. Thanks for watching.